Hey guys, so it looks like Apple's new maps was the idea of Steve Jobs. Now, although people are hating, you know, the, the maps app and stuff, I agree, I mean, it is shit. Um, but I can recall back in the day when Google Maps was released and people were complaining that Google Maps was leading people into the bridge and stuff, you know, like off a bridge. Um, this is the same kind of thing. It's just that, you know, Google Maps has been out there for years now and they've overcome this issue. And since Apple has just come into this, you know, playground, they're not, they're not aware of this issue, right? So, you know, although you might want to throw your hate at Apple and whatnot, you know, Google also received this hate. So, it's just a matter of time till Apple, you know, gets their shit together. That being said, I don't think the idea was a failure. I think the execution was failure. Um, I think they should, I think the idea was genius, you know, like, you know, they, a Apple and every other, you know, distributor like this should be, like every manufacturer should be, you know, creating all their, you know, main built in apps by themselves. But you shouldn't be, you know, building your own apps if you don't have a good app, you know, um, obviously it looks like Apple should have, you know, postponed their, um, new maps app from the year or two until they could you know work out the kinks and whatnot because I know Apple's trying really hard with this maps and stuff but it really it was not the time for them to release it whether Steve Jobs wanted it to be released now or not you know it's just not the time um, you know it's unfortunate but on the other hand Google has released their own maps for iOS so if you do want to switch to that by all means you can go to the iOS app store right now and download it there and it can replace the Maps app. That being said, I hope Apple does fix their Maps app soon because, you know, if they don't fix it soon, then more people are going to keep downloading the Google Maps app and by the end of the day, and by end of the day I really mean the long term, um, people will have all, like everyone is pretty much going to have the Google Maps app for the iOS. So even if or when Google, uh, not Google, when Apple does fix their Maps app, um, people don't need it. Don't people are not really going to switch over because they already have the Google Maps app, and you know it's worked out really well for them so far. So it's, you know, this little hiccup in their system right now of, Google, um, of Apple's could be detrimental to this overall, um, you know, long term uh, success of the Maps app. So I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, comment, rate, and subscribe.